And we'll have, uh, we have joining us now a wastewater strategist and managing director, CEO, Mark Press West Africa Limited, Idu Salau. It's nice to have you join us right now. Good morning. Uh, should I say Happy New Year in <laughs> February? <laughs> well, you do. We have seen him. No, you have seen I have not seen him yet. But yeah. it's fine. It's, it's good to have you join Thank us now. You. Now, you. seriously, let's get into this issue. Now, the, the issue of wastewater is on the front burner right now, mm. not just in Nigeria, but globally. But one would say in the layman's understanding, we have enough water. Why do we have to go into the issue of wastewater? Recycling. Oh, oh. Or recycling water that is already waste. See, let me first thank TVC for this kind of brilliant topic that you guys brought up for, for discussion. Thank you. This is one of the team, part of your responsibility for ed educating the public. Mm. It, 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 I thank you for that. No, we thank that you too. topic is germane. Mm. You say we have water here. Why are we concerning ourselves with wastewater? Mm -hmm. The water you have all over Lagos is useless to you. Well. Yes, because it's heavily polluted. Now, the problem again we are now having is that everybody is now abstracting underground water, mm -hmm. which is again heavily polluted based on activities of government. What is wastewater? That's what we should start from. Mm -hmm. Wastewater is the water that, you, that comes out from domestic use, industrial process, what do, you mean, what, do I mean, what do I mean by domestic use? You bathe in the morning, your kitchen work, your, 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 your washing of clothes, and this, this. And an average human being, we use nothing less than between 200 to 300 liters per day mm. per person of wastewater. Now, look at the population of Lagos, 18 million, multiply it by 200 to 300. So, for you to know the amount of wastewater that we use. The lagoon you see there, a lot of studies have been carried out on Lagos Lagoon. Aquatic animals there, they are gone because of infiltration of wastewater from industry, because of infiltration of solid waste from industry. The entire area here in Magodo, uh, Ketu, Ojota is already gone. They are, the, the water they are abstracting every day due to the positioning of uh, Olusos and dump site. Mm. That's what we call attenuation, seeping, seepage. Mm. The, the storm water that falls on that open waste, now that goes into the underground water, has every pollution on the underground water that they abstract around this area. So the iron content is more than the, uh, the, the approved limit. BOD, COD, chemical oxidant demand, biological oxidant demand. Now, the question is, why, how do we use wastewater to, for economic purposes? That is where we should look at. Mm. Job creation, economic purposes. The people that we have, in, in fact, the, the guy who left, when we were behind the scenes there, we were discussing about how wastewater in, uh, uh, created a problem for them in their agricultural uh, sector. He has a fish, fish farm. And in the fish farm, they just woke up one day and found out all oh, their fishes are dead. 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 Wow. They now realized, later realized that there was one company in Ikorodu that have discharged effluent into their, a Texas company, discharged effluent into the stream that they use to rear the the fish. The fish. What will cost it? The chemical oxygen demand may be higher than what those aquatic animals can assimilate. Mm. So this is where government now needs to come in to encourage the reuse and recycling of wastewater by industry first. Mm. And how will they do it first? Every industry must have a pretreatment. And this is what is in the law. We have the law. The Lagos State has well, the law. How effective are these laws? Stemming it, from what the, the example problem. you just gave. The problem now is that are they effective? The people that are supposed to regulate, mm. we have so many regulatory agencies. We have water regulatory agencies. We have wastewater office. They are all regulating. What they all go to do is to charge the industry that are discharging effluent treatment plants into the environment as a penalty. Right. They charge them, but that is not enough. What facility did Lagos State government put in place to check? For the reuse and recycling and recovery of this wastewater from the industry. Mm. Industry, by the time you are, you are putting up your, your facility to produce, mm. let's say, let me give you an example of how dangerous, because you don't see this wastewater easily. Mm. They go underground. Mm. A company that is producing a dye, a, 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 a dye, that's a chemical company, company producing dye, mm. and they have effluent being produced from the dye. 
and this dye continued to pollute our surface water every day, and that surface water infiltrated into the yeah. underground water, and that's what you are drinking. And that's what that we take cancerous. into boreholes and that all is, of that. that well, goes to our <clears throat> we have so, so, so the, the way you paint the picture is really scary. No, no, it should be. Really scary. It should be. But, but we have to leave it here now. This conversation will continue so we mm. get more enlightenment into what, in fact, it's like taking us to the classes right now. It was allowed. Thank you so much for coming. Thank you for coming. Yeah, thank you. Joining us so now is a wastewater strategist and MD CEO Mark Prest, West Africa Limited, Ido Salau. Thank you for joining us I'm on TBC Breakfast. Thank you. <laughs> <laughs> thank you. Now, talk to us about the effect uh, wastewater has on the sensitive ecosystem. Good. The entire marine environment will be heavily polluted because of the high pollution rate of wastewater coming from either domestic use or industrial use. So to limit this pollution rate is now we have to put some things in order. Yeah. What are the things we have to put in order? Infrastructure to reuse, recover, and recycle. Now, another aspect of danger of wastewater in our environment is this. Most of the farm produce that you see in the urban area like you go, go to the Odoyalaro River Bank, you see some people doing urban farming. Yeah. The water they take from Odoyalaro, that Odoyalaro name that you see, there's no magic name there. It's just because the upstream of Odoyalaro is a clean water. But when it mixed with industrial effluent from the industrial asset there, they call it Odoyalaro at that end because the, the, the water changes. The reason is that effluent from industries that are producing in that area is what make the name to be Odoyalaro. You now take Alaro water to wet your daily produce, uh, your, your, your agricultural uh, plantation. Yeah. What do you think you have? Those nutrients, micronutrients that is in the water will definitely come back to you mm. and human beings are eating it. Those are the danger. So, 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 so how, what can we do right now as a people, either from the individual level or, or the government, the government level? level. Mm. What, what now, can we do? I give you an example of UK. Mm. In UK today, they have about 54 million toilet facility. Yes, 54 million toilet facility. And they are using up to about 2 billion liters of water to take care of those 54 million, liters, uh, 54 million toilet facility. Mm -hmm. Now, in Lagos, where is the public water? Without water, you cannot talk of wastewater. The mm -hmm. public water that we have is down. Now, people now design to construct borehole, every house is now have borehole. Now, the borehole that we have, because of the nature of the infiltration of water, what is the treatment level of these our boreholes? And you know, even the cultural norm that we attract to our loved ones. Sometimes we bury our loved one in the house. Two meters just near it, we have our borehole. So the seepage going there, you're already drinking a polluted water. So really? the infrastructure that's supposed to be put in place, every Local government, everyone should have a wastewater treatment. And even there, we have wastewater treatment infrastructure as far back as 1965. All right. Wow. And the government, successful government, come and they store. The Dakar and the government came in mm -hmm. and built a sewer treatment plant in almost all, all, all local government. All right. What we, happened? We, 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 we have to leave it here. The, the point there is we just hope that uh, something is drastically done to handle and address Absolutely, this. Yeah. because uh, the okay. impacts uh, are mm -hmm. quite uh, heavy. Thank you very much, Ido Salah, for coming on the Thank program. you for